asking the hard-hitting questions you want answers to, but mostly just drifting off and staring blankly at the wall. It's The Big Biz Show with Russ and Sully. Hey, Big Biz Show, bigbizshow.com. Those are all the networks that we're on. Hey, like that. Here's some good news. Could you imagine when you hear the word pancreatic cancer, knowing that there is a potential FDA clinical trial a coming? Well, that could be around the corner for our next guest, Kenneth Wagner. He is the CEO, President, General Counsel for a company called Pharmacide Biotech. They are publicly traded under the stock symbol PMCB, PMCB, Pharmacite.com. He's joining us here in studio. And uh, let's talk. So we've talked about the pancreatic cancer side. And, and obviously, you know, that, that's, that's always bad news when you hear anything with cancer and, 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 and such. And the, we, even you might be watching me in New York City or listening to me down the road in Dallas, Texas. But San Diego, California is a premier, uh, is, is a premier research site because of UCSD and Scripps and everything else and Salk right. Institute for Cancer. Um, uh, so it's kind of near and dear to us here in the city of San Diego. But you're not only in the, in the, in, in the cancer space, you're also in the diabetes space as well. We are. Talk we about are. that a little bit. Well, it's, it's, uh, we use the same technology, we just use a different cell line to do something else. Mm -hmm. uh, for diabetes, we, we, we uh, are, use three different types of cell lines, we're developing three types of cell lines that we encapsulate in the same capsule. So once again, the cell in a box sort of analogy. It is, right? Uh, which I'm, I'm going to want to go into and sort of explain in more detail in a minute or two. Sure. Um, uh, these these uh, cells, which are, are shown there in front of you. Yeah, Chris, yeah, Chris they, can, Chris they, can Chris, they, yeah, there you go. They, so for, they, eventually, for our, they eventually get into a syringe to be used. So on the TV screen there, and our radio audience can't see this, but we'll, we'll post this up on the website, you can see it. So the syringe there, the, so the cell is, is in the vial and, and it eventually ends up in a syringe like we're seeing. It. Right, and the little red dots that you see in here, uh -huh. they're about the size of the head of a pin. Okay. Th per those per are the, those are the cells in a box? Th those are the capsules that, that we call cell in a box. Okay. Uh, they're they're porous. Okay. They're made of this unique material. Mm -hmm. There's no other uh, no other material like it in the world. No other encapsulation material like it mm -hmm. in the world, sure. and it has attributes that sure. no others have. So this is we, not only drug. This is drug delivery. It, it's just, it, it's, it's two a in one. It's a combination okay. device. Interesting. Okay. So for diabetes, what we do is we encapsulate um, genetically engineered cells. Again. In, in one case, a liver cell line that will. Read your blood glucose level. Well, uh -huh. as the uh, blood brings the uh, the therapy through, therapy brings the blood through the pores in the capsules. You right, because the they're pores, as pores. you mentioned. Um, it reads the blood glucose level. It generates insulin. The, the cell stores the insulin. And then when you need it, it gives it to you, and it neutralizes your baseline. Well, so, let me, so, so it takes care of your diabetes. That's, that's one well, cell let me, line. Let, let me put the business hat on. That is a giant market size. Uh, I mean, that, it, that is an enormous market size as far as the diabetic side. Uh, it, it's the largest healthcare crisis in the world. So, so in, in one side, the most egregious number one killer in the world, uh, number one killer in the world, pancreatic cancer. On one side, the other side, the biggest disease afflicted in, this, in, in, in the entire world. You're dealing with that. It's the same technology, different drugs, obviously, but the same technology to deliver those. Those, and, and you are in both in, in both of those verticals. Exactly. Where do you guys go next uh, with respect to both of these? Now, obviously, the, the clinical the the, the 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 clinical trial side is probably uh, you know the holy grail uh, for for taking the next step. It, 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 validating the technology is the number one goal. Right. Once we do that, and that's that. That should come in fairly short period of time. Sure. Uh, provides us the opportunity to treat all forms of solid cancers. Sure. So go back to cancer. Um, again, these capsules are porous. Right. Uh, we use we implant these capsules for pancreatic cancer. We run them up. Uh, we run a catheter up through the leg and put them as close as we can to where the cancer is, where sure. the tumor is. Once those capsules are set. Right. Uh, about 300 capsules are implanted. Mm -hmm. In each of these capsules, there are 10,000 genetically uh, modified cells that will convert this inactive chemotherapy drug mm -hmm. I talked about. Sure. In, in our case, we use a, a drug called diphosphamide right. from its inactive form to its active form right at the site of the tumor. So what you have is targeted chemotherapy. So and is, and does targeted the chemotherapy exist in its current, uh, the, I've never even heard of it. I mean, I, you, not, you hear targeted laser therapy, you hear a bunch of things for cancer, but you never hear targeted chemotherapy. That's right. There is no such thing as targeted chemotherapy until we came along. And what happens is this, this 
Ifosfamide are the chemotherapy agents that we use to treat pancreatic cancer, and in fact, all solid tumors, um, will be normally converted in your liver. There's a complex system that does that. But what happens is the capsules, when they're, cl when they're set close to where the pancreas tumor is, the capsules themselves act as an artificial liver, so you get optimal concentrations of the chem chemotherapy drug right at the side of the tumor, so you have a bio-artificial liver right at the side of the tumor. And, and there is, uh, there, there's, a, there's a lot of resources on the Pharmacite website, Pharmacite.com. Once again, Kenneth Wagner, Kenneth Wagner, the CEO, President and General Counsel of Pharmacite Biotech, and they are publicly traded under the stock symbol PMCB. PMCB is their stock symbol. Uh, you know, for, for you folks as a, as a company that, that's sort of, I mean, to say you're cutting edge uh, is probably an understatement. Um, you know, between live cell encapsulation, your cell in a box therapy, the, the pancreatic cancer therapy, the diabetes therapy, uh, you know, as a CEO of a public company, you can't spill too much. However, there's got to be other novel therapies you're thinking about. Anything you can share with us? Uh, yes. Uh, we have a, a, the same therapy that we use for cancer we're going to use for uh, something that doesn't exist, and that's uh, a way to stop the production and accumulation of malignant ascites fluid. That's fluid that weeps out of abdom abdominal tumor tumors into your abdomen. Mm -hmm. When it weeps out, it brings with it uh, cancer cells that seed and form new t cancers uh, in the abdomen. Uh, at some stage of growth of those tumors, uh, your belly becomes extended to the point where you look pregnant. Sure. Uh, it's, uh, it, you're in pain and you have difficulty breathing and it, periodically you then have to pull it off. And so you put it, you got to go through a procedure where you're you put a big needle in and you draw it off. Uh, it's expensive, it's time consuming, and it's very painful. Last of all, before I let you get out of here today, I'm gonna get a ton of emails, I can tell you, as I do every time I have these, I, I have these type of, of uh, therapies on the air, which is not often, so I can tell you, my mailbox is gonna fill up. What is the time, you know, what's, what do you think and you predict the time frame, if, if, if all goes well from where you're at now to market? Leading product candidate is pancreatic cancer. Mm -hmm. um, we're at the tail end of growing the capsules, mm -hmm. uh, growing the cells in the capsules. Once that's done, uh, the, the uh, syringes into which these uh, cells are placed will be frozen. Mm -hmm. The next day, they'll be unfrozen, and then they have to go through a series of tests. And you're seeing it right there on the screen right there, and that's, that's exactly what it is. Ken, we gotta have you back. It was fantastic stuff. Kenneth Wagner, CEO, President, General Counsel, Pharmacite Biotech, stocks of PMCB. You can go to PharmacyBiotech.com or Pharmacite.com. That does it for us. Yeah.